So. Okay. Let me make this screen big here. Everyone see that okay? All right. Just a sec, I need to get this. Okay, perfect. All right, so I just wanna say welcome to tonight's live info webinar about coaching. And um, we are the Ugly Tribe, and Ugly stands for Unique, Gifted, Lovable You. And we are a group of coaches. Um, we are women and men, moms and dads, brothers and sisters, and we have found common ground in health and fitness and personal development and helping other people better their lives through um, those things. And um, tonight we are going to have an awesome call. I'm super excited for all the ladies that are going to be speaking to you tonight. Um, some of my most favorite people ever. So um, we have um, Marlise and Chelsea and Amy, and they have been coaching. Um, some are newer, some are older. Marlise, you're the newest out of the three, six months. Um, Amy, she her one year anniversary was in January, and Chelsea, she pr basically started coaching about a year ago. Um, she was with Beachbody a little bit longer than that, though, with her transformation. So, um, kind of a variety, and they all have very different stories. They have very different takes on this, so it's going to be fun to hear from them. Um. First, I will introduce myself. Um, my name is Breezy Bitter, and I live in Territon, Idaho. It's a small town in Southeast Idaho. And I have two little boys. I am married to Matt, and he is a farmer. I used to be a teacher before I became a full-time Beachbody coach. Um, and I started off on my journey with Beachbody um, when I had just had my first little boy. I was a it was about eight months after that and nine months after that, I saw my friend posting about Beachbody and she messaged me and invited me to a challenge group and I decided to do it with her and I had my first transformation. Um, I then was a discount coach drinking Shakeology every month for about nine months and I finally decided, why not me? I'm going to start coaching. Um, at that point, I was pregnant with my second little boy. I didn't want to go back to work. And so I knew that I could make an income at this. I had seen my coach do it, and, and I decided to give it a try. So here I am. I've been coaching for, um, I think, 16 months now, 15, 16 months, something like that. And I was able to replace that quarter-time teaching income, and I was also able to match my husband's salary which was really amazing. Um, this year, a couple awesome things about the Ugly Tribe. Um, they became an elite team. This team is an elite team, and that basically means there's only 199 elite teams out of 270,000 coaches on Beachbody, and this team is in the top, so that's super cool. Um, and basically, my experience with coaching um, – I've just met amazing people. Um, the friendships and the experiences that I've had are just really just, they're unmatched, and every day they just get better and better. Um, and I've just grown so much as a person. My marriage is better um, through personal development, through um, fitness and health. I've just been able to really um, have some wonderful growing and changing experiences through Beachbody. So, um, it's changed my life, and I'm excited to um, share it with you. So I'm going to go ahead and start a little intro to Beachbody. So what in the world is Beachbody? Some of you might have a vague idea of what it is. Um, it was created by John Cogden and Carl Deichler in 1998, and basically it was a line of fitness programs, nutritional supplements, skincare line, um, and just focused around health and fitness. Um, they had different infomercials. They had some that tanked. They had some that took off P90X. And a lot of you are familiar with that. That was one of their um, most successful um, pro products that really um, took off for them. Um, the coaching network wasn't actually created until 2007. And that is what Team Beachbody is, um, is the coaching network. 
And this is a multi-level marketing company. And basically what it is, is coaches are independent um, distributors, um, if that's what you want to call it, um, for Beachbody products. So um, basically coaches have a common mission to help people succeed with health and fitness. Um, we want to end the trend of obesity, and that is the um, common thing among Beachbody coaches. Um, okay, let's see. All right, so why Beachbody, why coaching? And it's because it works. And there's three key components that you have as a coach um, when you're engaging with your challengers and um, when you're coaching people. You have fitness, the beach body workouts, nutrition, shakeology, and then the accountability and support. And those three things together wow. equal success. When you get people in a fitness group and um, you get them the proper nutrition, then can everybody? Can everybody mute? I'm hearing some voices. So if you're not muted, can you mute yourself? I just don't want everyone to. Okay. All right. So those three things together, that is success because you are having someone um, help you along your way. Um, you have peers that are with you along the way on your journey to um, a better health. So the, a lot of times people, they start fitness programs and they put them up on the shelf um, I had like five Julian Michaels DVDs and like all these yoga DVDs and things like that before I started coaching and I would go in and out of doing them. But once I found um, Beachbody and challenge groups, um, I had the missing link and that was the accountability and support of coaches and um, my coach and so, and the people in the group. So that's kind of the magic ingredient that we get to provide people and it's a really amazing experience. Um, this picture right here on the slide, this is my first transformation. This was a month after doing uh, Turbo Fire and Drinking Shakeology just after 30 days. Um, those pictures were taken 30 days apart and it was um, pretty cool for me. I was able to fit into a pair of jeans I hadn't fit into. Um, this was my actually my first post as a coach announcing to the world that I was a coach. That was my first post. So um, anyway, kind of fun to look back at that. All right, now um, we get to turn the time over to um, these other coaches and they are gonna address a few things. Um, basically, when someone approaches you about being a coach or when you see these coaches posting, um, you get all these excuses in your head and you get all these fears. And I had them too. I had them for like almost a whole year before I decided to finally sign up as a coach. So. The first one is it's an MLM, and I did say that, it's an MLM. And the first thing a lot of people think when you say MLM, they think, ooh, it's, you know, all these words pop into your head related to that. When really the general public, they don't have an understanding of an MLM, and it's really kind of different once you really get into things, um, different than what most people think on the outside. All right, the second one is I don't have money, and of course, no one has money, right? Um, I don't have time, no one has time, I'm not a fitness model, personal trainer, nutritionist, and I'm afraid. So these are some excuses um, that um, Chelsea and Marlise are gonna address, and then after they address that, we are going to hear from Amy. Um, she is, has had an amazing transformation with Beachbody. Um, she's also a coach, and she will and be sharing after this. So with that, go ahead and take it away, Chelsea. All right. So just a little bit about me really quickly. Um, I just lost my picture, but that was my husband and me and my dog right there. <laughs> um, we live in Big Fork, Montana in the lake country. There's tons of lakes up here. And my husband actually, uh, he runs a marina. And so we work on boats all summer. And um, so I actually got started, like Breezy said, I had kind of a transformation before I started coaching. And so I was in her first fitness group and I did Insanity and lost 20 pounds in two months. And on top of that though, um, I've struggled with depression since I was like 14 years old. I have had kidney problems and gallbladder problems and um, problems with my female organs and like just taking care of my body um, and doing that formula that Breezy talked about with nutrition and 
doing personal development and doing my exercise every day. It really has just changed my life and I, I look better, but I feel better and that's what's most important to me. So um, yeah, that's a little bit about me. Um, so about it being an MLM, uh, Breezy kind of touched on this a little bit, but how Team Beachbody started was um, all of these people were doing the programs that were available and they were going on YouTube and posting their transformations and sharing them on Facebook. And uh, the people that run the Beachbody business, they started seeing this and had people coming to them and saying, hey, I've sold so many of your programs. Is there any way I could make a commission off of this? And so unlike other MLM businesses where they kind of start with this idea of like, how could we get a ton of people involved with our company? It was more of, they had this awesome foundation built and people knew that their products worked. And so then they took that and they started building upon it and they just keep coming out with new products every year. And um, in the year that I've been a Beachbody coach, I, it's blown my mind. Like last February, they came out with the 21 day fix. And that is like core, all about nutrition and like what most people struggle with. Like you can exercise as much as you want, but if you're not getting your nutrition in, then you're probably not going to get very far. And I remember when that came out, that was the first time I had a really big challenge group and the program sold out in a couple of days. It was crazy. So it just, they just keep coming out with better and better products. And uh, so, yeah, I, I really like that about the company. Um, let's see. So multi-level marketing. Um, a lot of times when you hear that, you're like Breezy said, you that it just, it doesn't come across very good. And I kind of worried about that. In fact, that's one thing that I've struggled with a lot as a coach is I, I want people to know that I have integrity and I probably wouldn't have become a coach if I hadn't gone through a challenge group first and seen what the products could do for me. Um, I have parents that did Amway and I, I mean, like, I just, I know what a lot of MLMs are known for and it's hard to get out there and make, have people think that you're just trying to sell them something. And so that's where the leadership comes in, especially with the team that we have. Um, we have a lot of top coaches on our team, like, like the top hundred of the business. And there's a reason that they're in those spots and we get really, really good leadership all the way from the top of our upline. They're sharing things that they do with us constantly. So that's one thing that I like is you never feel lost of what to do. As long as you're doing the things that they're doing, like do as they're doing, then you'll never be lost and you will have success for yourself and for the people that you're helping. And I really, really like that. Um, so I don't know, Breezy, did I miss anything that I needed to touch on on this? Okay, <laughs> let's go to the next slide. Okay, so cost. Um, this is something that I can totally relate to. Um, when Breezy asked me to be in her first challenge group, uh, my husband, the job that we actually moved up here to do from Idaho, um, he was kind of, they hired on too many people. So we started this new job and it was going really well. And then suddenly he didn't have any work to do. So we weren't getting paid a lot. And, um, I was working in a daycare and I wasn't making much money. I was working crazy hours and just, I was, I was the manager of the place and we didn't have anyone else working for us. So I was working from like six 30 in the morning to five o'clock at night. And that was if the parents were picking their kids up at on time, on time. Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was wild. Wild. But, but, uh, hold uh on. Hold I got on. an echo. I got an echo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Am I still echoing? Am I still echoing? I turned my sound off. Okay. Anyways, um, so when I when I started into getting my challenge pack and everything to get going with Beachbody, um, I actually we didn't have a credit card and 
Um, so what I did was I called my mom and I knew that if I just, if we scrimped for a couple of days, I could save the money to do what I needed to do to get this challenge pack. So I called my mom and I asked her if I could charge it to her credit card. And so she ordered it for me and shipped it to me in my name. And then a couple of weeks later, after I had saved the money up, um, I sent her the cash. So, but after that, um, I had this transformation because these products really work. And uh, I had people asking me like, what have you been doing? You've lost so much weight. And so I thought, well, I'll share this with them. And they started ordering. And so it paid for me to have my Shakeology every month. And it, when you sign up with that challenge pack, which is your workout and your Shakeology together, it, uh, you can get signed up as a coach for free. You don't have to, if you haven't paid that $40, you can pay it and get it sent back to you. Or if you sign up right away with the challenge pack, then you don't have to pay that $40 at all. So, um, I had people that were interested in, in what I was doing because they saw that it worked. And so I didn't even, after, after my initial jump into the business, I didn't even have to worry about business from day one. My Shakeology has been paid for because if you get three customers ordering Shakeology on a regular basis, you get enough commission, which is 25% of what they're buying, to pay for your Shakeology. And so that's been a blessing to us because Shakeology has really been something that has helped me um, with all of those problems that I had that I was talking about before. So, so yeah, when you look at it at first, you have a $40 sign up fee that can be waived with your challenge pack purchase and those start at $140 and it's a workout that you get to keep for life and it's 30 meals. So it's not like a gym membership where you're paying to go out of your house to work out and taking all of like, all of, like time and that's what that's what and so you get to keep more time because you're working out at home and you're getting meals included with that. So really, I, it's kind of a no brainer to me. Um, and then there's a $15.95 monthly coach fee. What that covers is like Beachbody. I don't know if you guys turn on your um, TV at night, you'll probably see a Beachbody commercial or on a Saturday morning. They do a ton of advertising for us. And so, and they don't compete with us. Every time a customer orders through those infomercials, they get sent to coaches who are being successful in their businesses. And I've actually had customers that I'll just pop into my office online and I have this commission and I haven't sold anything. And it's because Beachbody has sent me a customer that ordered off of their website. And that, is one of those things that's included in that $15.95 a month fee. So um, you get a website that's completely set up for you. You just have to add a picture and change a couple of things to personalize it. And they have 24-7 customer service. So if you have a customer that needs to change something or they need to add something or whatever they need to do, if they've got questions, they can call that customer service and get taken care of. And um, they, it's just, I don't know. I, I have been blown away by Beach Fundy's customer service. Um, and then, yeah, your monthly Shakeology, which uh, if you are going to go into this, you want to be using the products and be a proof that the product works. And so I've had coaches that ask me, you know, do I really have to drink Shakeology? Technically, you don't have to drink Shakeology to keep making income, but if you're not going to walk the walk, why talk the talk? That's how I feel about it. And so like, why are you, why would someone buy something from you if you don't use it yourself? And I drink Shakeology sometimes twice a day just because I know what it does for me. But so what you get for that much is the 25% commission. And so every time you sell something, you get 25% of what you've sold. Um, you get bonuses, which actually most of my income comes from bonuses. It's not like I'm going out and selling hundreds of Shakeologies every month. Um, I get, every time my coaches sell something, we get part of their commissions 
on top of that. And I have paid off a credit card with that. So I think that's pretty awesome. Uh, you also get a 25% discount. So your psychology is cheaper. Anytime you want to buy a new program, it's cheaper. Health and happiness. If I could throw all of the money away that I have made with Beachbody, I would do it and still continue coaching because like I said before, the tools that we give people, they're life changing. And it's not just about getting them skinnier. It is the transformations that I've seen. I have more people on my team that have gotten over hard things like depression or like suicidal thoughts or um, I don't know, you just, you learn people's stories and I can relate to that because I've been there before. I have, I just, I know what that feels like. And just because of the tools that we've been given in this business, it's whole health. It's not just the body, but it's the mind and the spirit. And that to me is priceless. So I don't think I could even, I don't know what to say about that anymore, but um, I already talked about the free customers. That's those leads that we get from the uh, infomercials. And yeah, it's a priceless investment. So let's go next. <laughs> Thanks, Breezy. Okay, so um, when you think about that $40 initial investment and then the investment that you make every month after that to keep your business going, um, and you can think about a franchise like Wendy's and they have to have $500,000 in liquid assets with a million dollars of net worth. And so when they start, that's what their investment is somewhere between $250,000 and $600,000. I don't know how many people have that much money laying around to stick into a business, but I can tell you that even after investing that much money, you're going to run yourself ragged trying to keep that business going and get it off of the ground. And so when you compare it to a beach body business that you have a $40 initial investment or the cost of a challenge pack, which comes with product that you get to keep for the rest of your life and that coach fee that pays for all of that advertising. So you don't have to run yourself ragged trying to get your name out there. That is like, a priceless investment in yourself. And um, this picture right here, this is our team. We had a retreat in October and that man there in the middle with the striped red and gray shirt on, that's Scotty Hobbs. And last year, I think he finished six in the business as far as how many coaches there were. And so he was in the top 10. And um, just listening to his story, he he's had a hard past. He was addicted to drugs and um, went home and drank every night and just, he was working himself ragged for a minimum wage job. And he just had this dream inside of him that there's gotta be something more. And he started doing P90X and had that transformation. And people started asking him if he would consider coaching. And finally he started and in three years, he has made over a million dollars. And he came from nothing. Like if you knew Scotty before and you know him now, he's just so down to earth. He hasn't changed so much as like, oh, he's a millionaire now, so you can't relate to him at all. He's just a normal person that has gone through hard things, but he's taken them and invested in himself rather than just letting his life slip by and just working his butt off for no change and getting out of the stagnant life that he had. So, and every person in that picture from our team, they're all doing that. It's just, it's mind boggling really to see the changes that people who are serious about the business, like it's easy when you look at that $40, you can either think that it's really expensive or think that it's really cheap. And if you go the cheap route, then you might not put as much time into it as if you had bought that Wendy's franchise that, you're paying between two hundred and fifty thousand and six hundred thousand dollars. Like, so if you take it and you consider that initial investment as you're handling a million dollar business, you can make a million dollars with this business if that's what you want. And so it just it's just how hard you want to work for it. But yeah, we'll go to Marlies now. <laughs> 
Perfect. Can you hear me? Okay. All right. So my name is Marlise. Um, I will cover some more objections, but just really quick. I was asked if I wanted to do a challenge group last February, right before the 21 day fix came out. And like two weeks before that, I had had two patients ask me if I was pregnant and my baby was five months old. And it was like that moment that I decided something had to change. <laughs> that is like the worst feeling in the world. Um, anyway, so Chelsea that just spoke is actually my coach and she invited me to do a challenge group and um, I didn't really even have any objections. I was just like, yeah, I, I've been praying for something. I need something that's gonna help me. So did the challenge group. Um, I loved the Shakeology, so I asked her if there was a way I could get it cheaper. And she said, you know, be a discount coach. So I signed up for that, finished the challenge group. Um, she had added me to the coach, the team page, and I just loved the atmosphere. Everyone was just so kind to each other. They helped each other out. Um, and they made it, I mean, they made it look super easy. So I just, I asked her if, you know, she could help me out and teach me what I needed to know so that I could help other people. I, I really didn't have objections at that time because that's what I wanted to do. That challenge group had changed me. And I just wanted to pass that on to other people because it's just such, <laughs> it's such a sad, sad feeling when you're living your life and you don't even realize you're depressed. You're just going, you know, day to day and you're just going through these motions and it's the same thing over and over. And you don't even realize there's a problem until after you start exercising and drinking Shakeology. So um, I just really wanted other people to be able to have what I had. And yeah, so I'm just so grateful for Beachbody. But let's go ahead and talk about this slide. So my first objection is I don't have time. And who, I mean, who just has an extra five or six hours during the day? You know, everybody's busy. Um, this is my family down here. I'm married and I have three children. My oldest, she'll be five in March and my youngest is 17 months. And they <laughs> keep me running. I work one night a week. Um, it used to be more, but I've actually cut back at the hospital. Um, I'm a registered nurse, and I, I mean, I don't have a ton of time to just, you know, throw into Beachbody. I, I don't think anybody really does. I think it ultimately comes down to priorities and where your priorities are. Um, you can grow your business as fast or as slow as you want. And um, you, I mean, you can pick how many hours you have each day to Put into it it's all about prioritizing your time obviously like for me my family is a huge priority I would not put them on the back burner so that I could only work on beach body all day every day um, and so I just have to you know get up a little bit earlier and work on beach body for a couple of hours and then you know spend time with my kids throughout the day do the things that I need to do not clean my house very often though because it's kind of a mess but what do you do priorities <laughs> Anyway, um, I really just love working with my challenge groups, and so I make it a priority to, you know, talk to those people and make sure that they're doing okay because I want to make sure that they're getting everything from me that they can so that they can make that lifestyle change. But I also want my family to know that they're important to me. So um, if it's important to you, you do. You make time for it. And... Um, like really, you just, you schedule it in. Like you have a baby, you feed your baby while you're, you know, listening to an audiobook. You do the dishes while you're listening to the national wake up call. You make it work. And um, there are times when, you know, you do have to sacrifice things. Like sometimes my husband will come home at night and he will let me work on Beachbody and I might be sacrificing a little bit of time with him but because I know I don't have as much time with him later on in the week, we actually have more quality time. Um, I feel like I now have more quality time with my children also because the time with them I'm realizing is just so special. Um, so, I mean, another sacrifice. Like, 
before I used to just play like, I don't know, Candy Crush or I don't know, games like that. My husband would be like, really, you're doing that again? And I'd be like, yeah, don't judge me. But anyway, um, <laughs> it's, it's just the things you have to cut out. You know, you don't have to watch that television show on TV. If, if the business is important to you and helping people is important to you, then you will cut that out and you will realize that you will grow so much more if you take that extra 45 minutes to read personal development. So anyway, that's, um, that slide. So let's go ahead and move on. Thank you. So the next um, objection that we get sometimes is I'm not a fitness expert. I'll tell you right now, I am not a fitness expert. Like I'm trying to learn what I can, um, you know, learn a little bit more each day, but I didn't get a degree in fitness. I don't think anybody on this team is a fitness expert. Um, but it doesn't matter really. People are inspired by your journey and not your destination. And I totally believe that. Um, people will relate to you so much better if they can see that you were like them at one point in time. They will be able to relate to you and um, yeah, they'll, they'll follow you more because, you know, I mean, kind of just thinking about it, there are celebrity trainers and I would never feel comfortable paying a celebrity trainer to help me out because I would sit and look at them and I'd be like, oh, they're judging me. They're thinking I'm not doing this right or I'm not very good at this. But when you're not an expert and you're just, you know, trying to help where you can and add value to people's lives, they will relate to you so much more. And, um, yeah, they, they're just so grateful when they can relate to you, when you can connect and you have something in common um, that you can build a relationship around. Those are the people that you will really be able to help. So um, be proof the product works, and Chelsea kind of touched on that a little bit. You, I mean, you can do other workouts. You know, you don't have to be doing a beach, only a beach body workout. You know, you can go to the gym and lift weights if you want, or you can do body beasts, which would probably be better. Um, but if you're, you know, <laughs> if you're wanting to go lift weights at the gym, that's okay. But you can't, people will not want to, you know, be in your challenge groups if you're not showing them that you're changing by using the Beachbody products. And Shakeology is amazing stuff. I don't know why anybody wouldn't want to use it anyway. So, um, also, you're not selling, you, you're sharing your story. I don't know anyone that really wants to sell things to people. I know I don't. There's no way I could go and knock on people's doors and say, hey, buy this. Um, you're sharing your story and because it's your story, people will relate to that and they will, um, you know, they will want to be your customer after you're building that relationship. So lead with passion and purpose. You really do have to have a passion for this. Um, really for anything in life, if you want to be good at something, you need to have a passion for it. And when you have that passion, you'll find your purpose. Um, and then it's about progress and not perfection. Everyone can be better than they were yesterday. And I really like that to go along with that. I kind of like, um, you don't have to be the best, just better than you were yesterday. And it is, it's all about progressing. I, I've always struggled with this growing up. I was very much a perfectionist and, um, like that's what I was taught. My parents, you didn't do anything unless it was perfect. And now I'm realizing more and more that it's all, I mean, it really is about the journey and it's about being better every day and working to be better. It's not getting it right the first time. People will want to follow your journey as you progress and they'll want to see that progress. So next slide, please. Thank you. I'm scared. Um, and really who? isn't scared in the beginning it is it's hard to start something new when I mean you're excited sure I was excited I think everyone has that excitement in the beginning but I think when it comes right down to it you do you get nervous you get afraid you don't want to sell stuff um I I've always kind of had a really hard time 
building relationships with people. And that's another thing that I love about Beachbody and, you know, being a coach is that I'm learning to build relationships with more people. And so, you know, I don't know enough people was something that I was a little bit afraid of. And I don't know how to use Facebook. I was one of those people that would post like once or twice a year and it would be pictures of my kids or, you know, things like that. I didn't think anybody cared to listen to what I had to say. I didn't really want to share anything. I thought my life was personal. Um, but we help, you know, everyone helps with that. You just, if you have a question, you just ask on the team page and you get like 50 responses within like 10 seconds. <laughs> Maybe not that fast, but it's really, really quick. Everyone is just so good. We're like one huge family. And so, um, honestly, I'm a shy person. <laughs> and I'm kind of a little bit of an introvert. So if I can do this, you can do this. And I'm busy. We already kind of talked about being busy. Um, I don't want to bug my family. Nobody ever said you had to bug your family. You don't have to talk to your family about Beachbody if you don't want to. Um, I know I haven't really talked to my family until recently and we're doing this really fun sibling challenge now, but I didn't want to bother my family. I thought that they wouldn't care. I thought I wouldn't have support and, um, my husband's family, they're all on board right now and they're just, it's fun. We're having an awesome time and getting to know each other better. And then, um, I don't know what people will think of me. And I promise you that as you do your personal development, it will be so, so much easier to just not even care. There are still some times that, you know, I worry, well, what's so-and-so thinking about me or whatever, but you will be so much happier when you don't even worry about that anymore. I promise. <laughs> it's such a waste of time. If people want to come into my house and then go out to the car and talk about me, that's it's like their time wasted. That's just, they're wasting their life. I don't know, but don't even, I mean, you know, and if you're struggling, talk to one of us. We, we just want to help each other and we want to be there for each other and celebrate each other. And, um, it's just great. So the other one is I have failed before and nobody's perfect. I think we've all failed at something. We have to kind of just learn to embrace that failure um, and just remember there's people there to help us. You want to know the thing? So um, the one thing that all of these have in common are that they all start with I. They're all I. Um, so I really just like this quote, rise up and become the person you are meant to be because we each have so much potential. Even if we don't realize it right now, we do. Um, sometimes it just takes other people believing in us but you should just, just believe in yourself and go for it. So this is not about you. <laughs> just decide, commit, and then you can succeed. And there is never going to be a right time. Ever. Never, ever, ever. You will never um, just have it come to you and be like, oh, now it's time for me to coach. If you want to coach, now is the time to do it. Um, when you are... When are you going to live your life the way you want? And, you know, if you really think about it, you might, um, I don't know, if you're thinking about coaching, you need to just, just do it. Because in a couple of months, in a year, you might regret it. And you have so much potential. This business has a lot of potential. And um, you... I don't know. I would hate to um, not have tried this to see where my life could go right now. I've, I feel like I've kind of been a little slow with it, and I'm just I'm ready to take off. I'm ready to see where my life can go. And um, people are drowning. You can save them. And I feel like I was one of those people. I was one of those people that was drowning, and it wasn't even a year ago. And Chelsea saved me. <laughs> She was there for me, and she cared, and she helped me. Um, and there are so many people out there that don't even realize, you know, that that they are drowning, and maybe they do realize it, and maybe they're afraid to ask, maybe to approach them. But um, 
you really can help so many people. And just remember that if you're on this call, you're here for a reason. So, you know, you just need to act on those feelings. Don't, don't put those feelings off. Um, and don't be afraid. We're here to help you. So that's my part. Amy, sure. Can you hear me? Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Hello? Hello? Can yes. you hear me? Yes. Hello? Amy, we can hear you. You're good. Go for it. Yes, you can hear me? <laughs> yes, you're good. Okay. Um, I am Amy Jensen. And um, I don't even really know where to start or what to say. Um, looking back at how Beachbody has changed my life in a year is amazing. Um, the girl that I used to be a year ago was um, fat, unhealthy, unhappy, um, didn't believe in herself. I kind of lived in my own little world, my own little bubble and kind of living a lie and then I found Shakeology and Beachbody and I was able to start losing weight and to get healthy. Um, I have struggled with depression and anxiety for as long as I can remember and um, the Shakeology helped me like I'm on the lowest dose of um, my medication for my anxiety that I have ever been on. Um, so it's just helped me a lot. And I didn't think that I could be a coach because I didn't think that I could help them all the same reasons that they talked about. Um, but I just decided to go for it and do it because I wanted to change my life. I wanted to be the mom that my kids deserved. Um, I guess I'm kind of getting ahead of myself. I have four beautiful children, um, three girls and one boy. Um, right now, <laughs> I am currently going through a divorce, and it's hard, but it's, I'm grateful for Beachbody because if I didn't have Beachbody and the people, other people to focus on and the friends and family, then it would be really hard. Um, and I know it's hard for people to understand, but if it wasn't for Beachbody and Shakeology, I would still be in the bad situation that I was in. And because I got my self-esteem back and I was around uplifting people and doing personal development, I realized that I deserved more and I was worth more. And I wanted my children to know that they were worth more. And I don't know. I, can, I can't say enough good things about how Shakeology and Beachbody has changed my life. And especially right now, it's good to be able to focus and help other people because I've realized that there are people out there that only you can help, that only you can reach because they will understand and connect with you in a way that no one else can. And I mean, Everyone is still a work in progress. I am not where I want to be. I have my ups and downs with my weight, um, but I'm getting there and closer every day. And I'm just grateful that I took the leap and that I did something that just totally terrified me and was totally not me because I am shy. I was the girl who had no friends on Facebook. And then I went to having a lot of friends and opening up to people. Like, it's hard for me to open up and share my story because I'm very personal. And so it's hard for me to be like, you know, I struggle with depression and anxiety and I'm going to be 33 and I'm divorced and I have four kids. You know, this life doesn't always go how we plan, but I'm realizing that God has the plan for us and that we just need to keep failing forward to become the best person that we can become. So 
I'm just grateful for this team and for Beachbody and Shakeology. I love being able to help other people. Like that is my passion. I want to help other women, other people, because I know that there's another woman out there somewhere who is going through what I went through and is feeling how I felt. And I don't want her to be alone. I don't want her to feel how I felt for so long. And so I'm grateful for Beachbody and Shakeology and how it has changed my life. And I'm excited to help other women and other people and to see how it can change your life. Um, that's basically it. I'm going to end with, it's, this is my favorite quote that I found in a book and it's called, and it says, you are beautiful the way you are. You are real and you are flawed. We are all, no one can be a better you. You just need to be your best. And my um, theme is just take it one day at a time, one pound at a time. And that's what I'm doing. And if I can help other people and inspire other people along the way, then that's my goal. So that's kind of my story. And thank you for listening to me. Thank you so much, Amy. Amy's really amazing. If you're not friends with her on Facebook, you should go follow her and her page and her posts. She always has um, really great insight and really great things to say. So thanks for sharing, Amy. Um, just to close, I just want to say um, thank you guys for getting on. Um, again, this is um, obviously, like you can see, it's a life-changing opportunity. Um, you know, the Ugly Tribe, amazing group of coaches, amazing group of people. And um, we just, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to any of us. And right now we'll actually um, open up if anyone, we have um, time for just a couple of questions. So if anyone wants to unmute themselves and ask a question, you are welcome to do that right now. And no question is a dumb question. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm totally a person that doesn't like to, an to ask questions on live on the spot either. So I feel you. Um, so we have a couple different places you can ask questions. Um, I recommend messaging the person who invited you to this call. Um, ask them questions and um, concerns that you have and um, tell them what you liked about the call um, and then also some of you have been added to the ugly tribe coaching opportunity um, page feel free to ask questions in that group as well check out the files tab um, and we are so glad you got on this call tonight and we hope you took something from it so um, thanks everyone for getting on and have a great night <laughs>